Hello everyone. Today, we're going to learn how to port forward using the Spectrum app. Port forwarding can sound complicated, but it's really just a way to let specific traffic through your router to a specific device on your network. This is often needed for things like online gaming, running a home server, or accessing security cameras remotely. Let's jump right into how to do it with the Spectrum app. First, make sure you have the Spectrum app installed on your smartphone or tablet. Log in using your Spectrum account credentials. If you don't have the app, you can download it from the App Store or Google Play Store. Once you're logged in, look for the Wi-Fi tab or section. It might be labeled slightly differently depending on your app version, but generally, it should be pretty easy to find. Under the Wi-Fi section, you should see options related to your network settings. Look for something like Advanced Settings, Port Forwarding, or Manage Advanced Wi-Fi Settings. This is where the port forwarding magic happens. Now, you'll need to create a new port forwarding rule. Usually, there's an Add Rule button or a similar option. Click on it. Here's where the details come in. You'll need the IP address of the device you want to forward the port to. This is the private IP address assigned to your computer, game console, or whatever device needs the port open. You can usually find this in your device's network settings. You'll also need the port number you want to forward. This is the specific port that the application or game uses. Make sure to find out what port is needed for your specific application. You may also need to specify the protocol, which is usually TCP or UDP, or sometimes both. The application using the port should tell you this. In the Spectrum app, enter the device's IP address, the port number, or a range of port numbers if required, and the protocol, TCP, UDP, or both. Give your rule a descriptive name so you can easily identify it later. This makes it easier to manage your port forwarding rules. Double-check all the information you entered to ensure it's correct. Incorrect information will prevent the port forwarding from working properly. Save the new port forwarding rule. The Spectrum app may take a few moments to apply the changes to your router. After the rule is saved and applied, test your port forwarding to make sure it's working correctly. There are many online tools you can use to check if a specific port is open. That's it. You've successfully set up port forwarding using the Spectrum app. It might seem a little complicated at first, but once you've done it a couple of times, it becomes much easier. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, please like and subscribe. Consider supporting the channel through Patreon or by using our affiliate links in the description below. Your support helps us create more content like this. Let us know in the comments if you have any questions or suggestions for future videos.